I was in church Sunday morning. Oh yes, go to church. I had to give him something to do. <laughs> and the woman in front, the pew in front, she's hands clasped like this. And she's looking up at the sky. Because there was a bloody get hole in the roof. And she's praying oh so hard. Oh Lord, she says. First of all, you took away my favourite composer, John Barry. <clears throat> then, Lord, you took away my favourite entertainer, Michael Jackson. And now you've took away my favourite singer, Whitney Houston. Lord upon high, can I just remind you, my favourite politicians are David Cameron, <laughs> Nick Clegg, and they're very bad. I think we'll all agree with that. Yes. Dear, oh dear, what a shower, eh? I don't know. Anyway, I was in bed last night and uh, Joy was uh, getting a bit frisky, you know. They can't blame me, can you? <laughs> you laughing at? She's coming on a bit hot, you know what I mean? And I said, I didn't I won't bother to be quite honest with you. I says, no, I've got a headache. She gets straight out of bed, goes straight down the stairs, out the back door, into the shed, gets to the yard bush, back in the house, up the stairs, into the bedroom, gets in bed, and she's jabbing me in the back with the bloody handle of the yard bush. She says, what are you doing? She says, now you know how I feel when I've got an headache. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Well, have you all enjoyed yourselves, ladies and gentlemen, on your pretend Christmas? Good, good. All we'd like to say is, um, uh, if you have enjoyed it, then uh, make sure you go back and tell your relative coach companies that you've enjoyed it. Spread the gospel for us. That's all we ask in return. And if there is anybody uh, in the room who's uh, not enjoyed it, then please go back and tell everybody you've been sharing. Uh, <laughs> Other than that, ladies and gentlemen, uh, if I don't get a chance to speak to you uh, individually uh, before you go tomorrow, on behalf of Joy myself, all my family, all the staff and the entertainers at the Dalmont Hotel, we bid you a fond farewell. Hope to see you again sometime in the not too distant future. And uh, have you got a note? We bid you a fond farewell, ladies and gentlemen. We hope to see you again in the not too distant future. We'd like to wish you all a very merry real Christmas and a very happy and prosperous new year. Thank you very much. Thank you. By the way, when you've had bingo, don't go running off because we've got a piper coming all the way from Edinburgh Castle uh, to begin the new year with you very shortly after bingo. So don't push off. It's New Year's Eve. Thank you. Okay, we'll be about five minutes. Just sort the money out. If you want to get a quick drink, you've got to...